is Lucas and I'm from Elsima. And in this video I will show you how you can simply pair our remote control, um, it's Pentafob, to our receiver. We will need, of course, remote control, receiver and screwdriver for resetting. So, you have to be sure that remote control have batteries on. You can simply check that by pressing any button and you see the skewed light, that means that it's on. Also, receiver have to be on. Uh, you can check that by this light. So, before we start, we also have to check that our dip switch are in off position, like we have it here. Then you have to be sure that you know where are the program buttons. It's these buttons you can see here. So, in 5 channel you see 5 buttons, on 2 channel you see 2 program buttons. Here you can see also caption, program 1, program 2. So, we can simply uh, program our remote control by pressing any program button and in the same time we will press the button on the remote control. LED light indicates that everything has been successful and remote control is paired. Also this red light indicates the success. So right now we will pair the second button to different receiver. So I will just simply press the program button number one on the two channel receiver and in the same time I will press the number uh, two button on remote control. So, you see also everything has been successful and when I press the button again everything working fine. So what I will do next, I have to reset the remote control from our receivers. I can do it simply by the screwdriver. On every um, motherboard of receiver you can find simply the reset pin. It's two pins usually located really nearby the tip switch. So it's here on two channel it's here and on two channel plug and receiver it's here. So I will just short the pin for 10 seconds and be waiting for LED light. Okay. You see? There we go. We'll short also this two channel receiver. Okay. Here we go. And right now when I use the same remote control, you see that it's not paired. Please be sure that you know when you reset your receiver. Because what, what I did right now, it's reset not only this remote control, but any other remote controls which has been paired before. So be sure that you know about this, that you know that it's reset everything, every paired remote control. So, and this is basic features for the advanced programming you can see also next video where we can show you how we will use penta programmer thank you for watching and comment below